Hey, Connor and Everything Farm here, and I finally made it here. Now, obviously, when we need to get somewhere efficiently, we walk in a straight line. So welcome to uh, this new video, and this is about organized farm, organized plantings. Some people may think that I plant straight and even beds and line things up just so they look nice. And that's just not true. The reason I line things up is because it's efficient and makes the farm more profitable. That's why. Now I have permanent beds here at Neversink Farm. Every bed is, is in a permanent place and will be for a very, very long time. They're staked, but they've also been measured out. So every bed is equidistant from another bed. Every bed is the same width. So when you look at it, if you look at it from above or from the side, you're gonna see it's all straight. And that just makes things so much easier, so much faster. You know, when you see, you know, really successful farms, you know, their plantings are very, very organized. And so how do they do this? How do they make things really organized? Well, I just, you know, cut up my farm into a field, a section, then a bed, a number everything so that everybody knows where to go and keep it weed free so that I have less disease, less competition with the plants, less pest problems. <clears throat> when I first lay out a field, I measure everything out very specifically. If I'm gonna have a 14 inch path or a 16 inch path or whatever the, you know you decide you want for putting totes, harvest totes or, or weed buckets or whatever it is in the path, that every single one is equal and that you know where the paths end and the beds begin. So while there's a little bit of a gray area, right, when people are walking, right, I know that my bed edge is right there. And if I go to the other side, right, and that's going to be 30 inches. And then there's going to be, on most places on the farm, it's going to be a 14 inch path. And then every section I have is eight rows. And then every row is 100 feet and every bed is 50 feet. And this just makes it so easy to plan. It makes it easy to plant, it makes it easy to cultivate, it makes it easy to send people to a certain place on the farm, a specific bed and get something or weed something or uh, plant something, turn something over and there's no confusion. I don't need to walk somebody out there. So straight beds, straight rows are ideal in a annual vegetable production system. It looks great and it's just so much easier in the end. So this is section seven. Eight rows, 100 feet, two beds, divided by sprinklers. All my workers can find where I am and get to me quickly. This is section two. Same size as section seven, just in a different spot. And everything's numbered in a specific way so that everybody can find it. This year we planted section three with beets. So I'm surrounded by beets in section three. Sections are 30 feet by 100 feet. And they have 14 inch paths and 30 inch beds as always. This is section seven. Onions are in section seven, including the leeks. And you can see it's straight, it's even, and we used a gritter to do it. A gritter combined with a paper pot transplanter. That's why it's so straight. When the field is organized, plantings are organized, it's much easier to do block rotation. Now block rotation is not a priority on my farm, and I think it shouldn't be a priority on small farms but it's something that should be done and you should make it easy. And a section can be planted to one thing and then moved around and then you plant another section with it the next year. You can divide it up into halves or quarters and then use those quarters to plant what you want to plant. And so when I'm doing things on a spreadsheet, I just have my sections, half sections, quarter sections, and now I can just move around the vegetables from year to year. And I don't have to think about it much because I don't want to invest a lot of time into it. 
but I certainly don't want to just keep planting things in the same space. And so by organizing my farm, by dividing it up, making it straight, I get all of those benefits. Workers need to go they they workers can get to where they need to go easily without my assistance. We can cultivate very easily. We can rotate things very easily. <clears throat> it just makes things so much more efficient to have everything divided and permanent beds and named and numbered. All right. So thanks for watching and uh, until next time.